Yo what's up guys, this is Alias and in this video I will show you how to make these really cool looking lion path animations in After Effects and this tutorial is part of a bigger motion graphics tutorial series and I will put a link in the description for a whole playlist where you can find more easy tutorials but yeah I'd say let's start with this one so let's go into our, our new composition and I just made a little background but let's focus on the on the light paths and animations so let's just add a new shape layer right here and then make sure to select the pen tool on top of this tool setting thing yeah and with the pen tool selected we can just draw a path which the line should follow something like this maybe and yeah make sure to select the shape layer and open it up and open up the contents, open up the shape and select the fill and press delete so we just get this line so then we can open up the stroke settings and turn up this value right here to something like 30 and yeah this looks good but of course it's it's not animated at all so let's do this real quick so let's go to contents again and press add to add the trim paths effect and yeah open this up as well and decrease the the end to zero at the beginning and just place a keyframe and then go forward to like yeah three seconds or however fast or long you want it to take and just turn this up to 100 again so we will have this nice animation but we also want the tail to come with it and not just be like this so let's go not to the beginning but a little bit after the beginning and also press the keyframe at start and then just go right to the end and a little bit after the end as well and turn up the start to 100% so this just moves this way and depending on how we place the start keyframes um, yeah the, the length um, changes so if we pull this forward the length will be longer if we put it backwards the length will be shorter but yeah this is up to you basically I'll just go with this one no not this one with this one and yeah this looks cool but we will also want it to look a little bit better so let's also go to the stroke settings again and change the line cap to round cap so we've got this rounded cap and we can also go to taper and change the start length to 100 so we'll get this nice effect and yeah that's it already you can of course just duplicate these and make sure the pen tool is selected to just yeah give it some other paths like this maybe and yeah, you can just make multiple ones and yeah that's it basically thanks for watching and yeah make sure to check out the motion graphics playlist which i will link right in the description so see you there